We're back. Let's see what Damon wants. What do you want, Damon? Or actually, yeah, what do we want? What does Carlyle want? That's the real question. Uh, why do we walk all the way over there? Carlyle, you're looking well. Would be a lot better if you find a way to fix this engine, Damon. I haven't stopped trying, but all roads lead to a dead end. Sorry, I didn't mean. Never mind. Glad you're all right in any case. Nice forge you've got here. Best I've had in years. Perfect. Mistress of the house lets me operate from here for a fair price. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't happy. Good. Someone should be. Certainly. What you got, man? What do you got for me? With... Oh, that is... That is something that he like. Plus two to attack. Oh man, that is. Oh, that. that oh man. Want that? What are my current gloves? Increased deck score. Okay, we need to find stuff to sell you, my dude. What? What don't I need? Need that lever handle anymore. Shout if you need anything else. Okay, hang on. Gloves. Gloves. Ooh, Ethereum doesn't have gloves, but that's fine because you can actually use them. Is this considered armor? No. Why did that, uh... My dexterity drops that much that my AC goes from... Or goes from 18 to 13? Oh, we can know. Why? Don't I have armor defense? Which does a lot more? Am I wearing armor and not realizing it? Assume nothing. 9 to 22. Okay. So it's probably that we want to wear then.
road ahead. Okay. Moving ahead. You gotta figure out how to get up to our boy. Perception check. Oh, that's all like uh bodies that we could dig up though. Wait, wait. How do I get up here then? Is it this way? This way maybe? get to uh We physically cannot go that way. So, <sighs> so it's over in... Uh, I don't know what that check was. I wasn't fully paying attention, so, uh, screw me. Uh, how do we get... How do we? Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Ah. The security shouldn't be too tight. A few charmed innocents, maybe. I don't know. 
You are intruding in the palace of Kazador Zar. Leave now, citizen. The guard's words are clear, but spoken without thought or intent. Behind her eyes, you see nothing. She must be one of the charmed thralls Astarian mentioned. Uh, another word from you will be, uh, I'm inspecting security on your master's orders. Just enough. Of course. Whatever the master desires. Enter freely. Okay, let's go this. Memorize these fools, fools, rules, and do not fail to follow them. Do your job silently, do not speak unless spoken to. Master likes it quiet. If you're not busy, find something to do to look busy. The master likes diligence. If you encounter the master, stand still and cast your eyes down with defense. Master likes to be respected, no whistling. Okay. Let me save it. And apparently someone wanted to be in Discord while we both played and I didn't realize that, so I might hop in that soon. Okay. Uh, one second. Uh, no, it doesn't. We're just gonna keep going. We just rolled for something. I don't know what. Just say something about the crowd. How are you doing? Uh, I am exhausted. But I, I could am imagine. Good. What are you in Act Two in this game so far? I'm oh, actually boy. getting prepped for Act Three. Oh, nice. I you beat it at once already, right? <clears throat> no, I'm still in Act Three. Okay, but you you're done with the first two acts. So, yes. uh, basically. I was ready to walk into Act 3, and I left, and then Halden was sad because I didn't lift the Shadow Curse, so then I reloaded so that I can lift the Shadow Curse. Yeah, uh... Forgot about that. Yeah, as far as I'm concerned, he's dead in my playthrough. <gasps> Why is he dead?! I what told you, you already. Do? I tried to lift the Shadow Curse, and he went through a portal, and enemies destroyed the portal, and I haven't heard from him since. So don't let them destroy the portal, because as far as I know, you don't get them back. Oh, 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 Arabella is attacking me. Uh, wait. What am I looking for? I don't think I want to be in here. Also, have you been doing a good job of, like, doing everyone's side quests as, they, as you go? Am I doing them all? No. Okay. I also haven't been. But a few... Oh, and then, like, the one I was gonna leave uh, and fight the Absolute. Or at least the, the people for the Absolute in that, like, weird fleshy world. And Brian was watching me play, and I was just gonna go through, and he was like, Hannah, Will will literally die and go to hell if you walk into that door. <laughs> Because I didn't realize you're supposed to go find that lady. 
So I was just, I was just like, uh, Wait, I don't want to have to go the whole way back. I don't have Will in my playthrough. Are you serious? Did you kill him too? No, I just don't have him in my party. I haven't been using him. He doesn't have to be in your party. Wait, what happened for you then? There, the lady that enslaved him. Yes. You have to save her in the fleshy weird world in Act 2, or Will gets sent to hell. Maybe I saved her at one point then. You probably did. I made a beeline for the absolute. Oh, wait, wait, and wait. And I missed literally every other room. When when you're in the, uh, the Mind Flayer place after you defeat Kethrak? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I did save her. Okay. Yeah, I did save her. I was very confused with the where you were saying you were. So I remember coming across her and that was it, pretty much it. Remember to read the ancient language book. You'll need to know some vocabulary vocabulary to be able to move freely within the palace, father. Uh Aw. Got a ring. Shadow blade. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> so that's progress. Now I'm trying to find a way to dump Gale so that I can uh, romance Asterion. Because I made the mistake of seeing his voice actor. You mean adult Stewie? Adult Stewie. Oh, don't call him that. Oh, no. Were you the one I sent that to? Yeah. I saw that before you sent <laughs> it to me, too, and I was like, everything. I can't unhear that. Where is Halzen? Uh... Is he not in my camp anymore? What a charmer. I remember I talked to someone at last light, and that's how I started like the quest to like get rid yeah, of the shadow art. curse. But where is Halzen now? Did you finish the quest line with like getting the thing for art? He so art in mine is dead. Oh. I walked into that room and he was a floppy body on the ground. Oh. So I, I used, I used speak with dead, and now I'm trying to find Halton. Maybe he's not here. <coughs> so he's not in your camp. He is not in my camp. Oh. Lizelle, Asterian, Dame Aelin, Isabel. Have you talked to him in Act Two, like in the over in the actual world? Not camp. Chamberlain no, suite? Is that where this Well, there's no marker here, so actually he might just be... Office? I guess we'll go to the office. Right, last light. I think he was in last light when uh, I did that whole thing. Before fucking it up. Uh, Enough time wasted. But yeah, I'm definitely going to be doing a second playthrough with the characters I didn't really play through with. Oh, for a key. And doing whatever the Dark Urge thing is. That's what I want to do is Dark Urge. I didn't realize there was like a kind of a character thing that was like, Hey, this is kind of like the intended thing. He's in Moonrise Tower? What the f Oh, is he in Moonrise because you, like, already killed Cathrak, maybe? Yeah. Something over there. It's annoying. Uh oh, this is awkward. Okay. Um. Read the diary. Uh, I know enough what matter in mind. Bro, ritual clean the I ground refuse. so I'm not walking through fire. What the? We stand in for missing Brat Asterion. Oh, Even if Kazador finds my body, the potion bone cloak sold me. It's promised to provide Strong a convincing man. illusion of death. Especially I've been seeing since a bunch I of leave. videos on Instagram about people romancing him, and you do it when he's in bear form. And I was like, you know, I don't know if I need to do that part of the playthrough anymore. Yeah, that that was the whole uh, yeah that was the whole thing about being able to fuck a bear in this game. Yeah, I didn't realize you literally were fucking the bear. Yep. I thought that it was just he mm -hmm. has a bear form. But, nope, uh, nope, you can. Nope. So fuck he a bear. got he got nixed from the option list. That that yeah, that's a choice to be able to fuck a bear. I... 
Okay, Sammy. so now, hold on, where are you going? Where are you going, oh, buddy? He is, he is dead. Am I supposed to follow, Halsman? Sir, sir, can you slow down? Please, sir. Uh. You, you have long strides. I am small tiefling girl. Wait, where? What? I'm trying to progress Asterion's story, and I don't know how. <laughs> Tonight we shall see his Are you gonna do bad Asterion or good Asterion? I didn't know there was difference. Oh. I will say no more. Please don't. Sinister door. Surely that won't be bad. Oh, I can't. I can't lockpick it. That's impossible. <laughs> door to Casador's ballroom. I am always encumbered. Hosted his most hedonistic nights. Unavoidable. You've never seen it closed, let alone. Wait, I have a barbarian. The door is covered in. Yeah, intricate which one's the barbarian? You can't see any. Garlock. I just followed him the whole way up here, and now he's gone. Round hollow. The barbarian, sexy tiefling lady. Crest. Lift the shadow curse. Me? Oh, just teleport. God damn it. The indentation is small and features an engraving of the family crest. Beyond that, it's a perfectly nice No, I can't succeed in that. God damn it. The one thing I noticed, uh... If you can't succeed with all the bonuses... Even if you still get in that 20, I'm pretty sure you still succeed. On certain checks. Wait, say that again. You can't even recognize the So like I had a check at one point that needed a 30 to succeed. And with all yeah, my but... bonuses, there's no way I was gonna get a 30. Like I fit uh, mathematically I could not. It's mine now. And I got in that 20 and it still counted it as a success. Oh yeah, I mean yeah. Same with with uh critical fails if you get a one and your bonuses would add up to win you still lose <laughs> oh i didn't i didn't realize that oh wait are they on the other side of the store then i fucking the door is covered in intricate Can i use every person to try and figure out oh okay where are you in great writing me there's writing like this all over the place sketchy sure someone's gonna get this why wouldn't you be Surely Why someone's going to get be? this. The indentation is small and features an ink. Like it's well be done. Standing up on these weird rocks. An intricate text. Mm, the porch. Can't see anywhere. Yeah. God damn it. In small round hollow. In the indentation I can't is small fucking get through the store. An engraving of the family crest. Beyond that, it's a perfectly normal mysterious door. Writing me? There's writing like this all over the palace. Some old, probably dead language of chasm. Don't burn yourself. The door is covered in intricate text. Oh, shoot. Okay, he's going into the portal. Ah. Oh. Don't fuck up the fight. <laughs> with a family. The indentation is small. I'm gonna get Daddy Halls and killed. Oh, shoot. I forgot that I was making food. Perfectly normal mystery. Serious I could have ended badly. There's writing like this all over the palace. Um. How many of these oh, do I want to make? And sealed. how long do I boil them for? Oh, fuck. Interesting. How do I get in there? Then? Are get you playing on magical normal? seal? No, I'm playing on tactician. Oh. <laughs> Screw <laughs> that. Honestly, it's it's not bad when you have two barbarians and a fighter. You're a barbarian, and then... I have Karlak, who's also Karlak. a barbarian, and I have Lazel, who's a fighter. Lazel is actually kind of OP. Well, that, that's the thing, like... In one round of turns, I get six to eight attacks between three people. And then usually I rock Shadowheart, which does Guardian Spirits or, or Spirit Guardians, and... I usually shoot, uh... Fuck, what is it? Guide and Bolt or whatever? Which gives advantage on the next attack roll on that enemy. So I fucking hit hard. Another guest for the Master Astarian. What are you doing here? Why aren't you downstairs? Well, obviously I'm on my way down now. So if you could just point us in the right direction. 
But you're too late. The, the, the doors have been sealed. The ritual is about to begin. Uh, what? A ritual? Perhaps we should not discuss this around strangers. Oh, yeah, you're right. Obviously. Speak, damn it. What's going on? It's the master's ascension. Once the ritual is complete, he is to be reborn. Even more Ooh, this doesn't seem good. powerful than before. You should be there. All his children were to attend. He'll be furious you're not. So on the only lesson. It's too late. Godi has sealed the doors and will not open them until the ritual is complete. Casador gave the key to Godi. How much money did you spend on groceries in a month? Old sack of bones. It does not matter. You're too Probably late. between like three and four hundred. Will be so angry it? that you missed the ritual. Yeah. He will do such terrible, terrible things to you. I do not but have I'm working any on right now, spending less waste. money on groceries. There's too much to do, too much to prepare. Yeah, I mean, it, it helps when I also don't work from home, and it's a lot harder for me to just bless us, master. Snack. Oh, okay. So you you have like. You eat out a good bit. I do, but it's also like I was I was telling Brooke about this uh a couple weeks ago, like between Monday morning and usually Thursday night I am home to sleep and that is it. So like I don't snack then, I don't like I don't use things like toilet paper, paper towels throughout the day like i mm. i use so little things during the week yeah whereas like people that work from home they do a lot of stuff at home that i don't do like snacks my my friends because this was basically i was having my friend go through my budget because like with how much money i make i should have way more money saved and I would like to buy a house in the next, like, year or two. So I chose, had her go through my budget. And I'm spending, like, over $1,000 a month on groceries. That's a lot for one person. That, that's exactly what Robbie said. She said, so she, her and her like, long-term boyfriend, they're not married, but they've been together, like, 11 years. I never know what to call him. <laughs> um, pseudo-husband. They spend about what you spend for the both of them. And, like... So she was looking at my budget, and she was like, Hannah, this is a little bit ridiculous. So I'm trying really hard, but I'm realizing it's because I, like, am lazy. And I don't like to cook, so I'll buy, like, Whole Foods pre-made meals and stuff. Because it's just easier, and they're healthy, so I don't have to feel bad. I was gonna say, bad. I know you shop at Whole Foods, and that is expensive. But Whole Foods has, like, ethical meat and stuff. So at the very least, I want to get my meat at Whole Foods, but like it is definitely more expensive. It is definitely more expensive. I know. Um, do they have coupons? <clears throat> no, there is. Okay, I didn't think so. There is some like discount stuff that you can do because it's like through Amazon, so that's nice. Like I got, I think I got ten percent off of every item that I bought. Yeah, like, I would say step one is stop buying. I guess everything but meat at Whole Foods, if you can. That's what, yeah, that's what I'm working towards. And, like, Thanks. even, like, I have a really bad tendency to get lazy and just order DoorDash. Like, tonight, I really wanted to get El Limon. And I was like, no, no Hannah, you yeah. don't need El I've been, I've been bad about DoorDash and also lately. I'm uh -huh. trying to, like, break that habit. Even though I DoorDash Taco Bell today. Oh, Taco Bell sounds good. Oh, it was so good. Um... But no, she was like, just think about, like, and it's working so far, but it's only been four days. Yeah. <laughs> but like, think about the trip that you want to take next and think of every dollar that you spend as taking away from that trip. And I was like, oh, that's yeah, a really that's, good way to think about it. That's a lot of time, like, when it comes to like, oh, maybe I want to buy beer. Or maybe I like want to order. I'm like, well, if I spend like 15, 20 bucks on that. Like, if I want to buy a new game that's coming out, literally, I don't drink for two weeks. And it oh, saves up that money. Or, yeah. you know, stuff like that. So it's a little, they're like, 
going to Wawa in the morning. It's like, if I don't go to Wawa in the morning, I don't spend 10, 15 bucks. I don't do that for a couple of weeks. All of a sudden I'm saving, you know, X amount of money, which can go towards the next video game or, you know, whatever next piece right. of exercise equipment I want to get. Mm -hmm. So. But you're too late to see the master. Yeah, it's de it's definitely a good way of like look at it as you're saving money, but you're being able to put that money towards whatever. Yeah, like instead of thinking of it as like, oh, I'm missing out on Elabone tonight, I can think of it as like twenty five dollars towards my next whatever I do. Yeah. So, oh my gosh, but it's hard because I'm like so lazy. <laughs> Same. No, oh, trust me, I am right there with you. I've had a frozen pizza in my fridge for like a week now, and I'm like, I should just bake that. It's going to take 10 minutes to make. Oh, that's okay. Time. That's even lazier than me. Yeah, I'm not that is. lazy. I just don't want to cook. Like, because it's, I guess it's not laziness. It's just so much time, right? Like, I, I work all day, and then like I go exercise, oh, that's, that's, and maybe I. That's my why friend. I do not like physically like make, make food, because I do not have time, especially yeah. if I work like 11, 12 hour a day. Oh, no. I come home. I don't want to do that. No, no, no. Cody is not worried by your but threats. Slowly working towards it, because <laughs> oh, my me. next trip so is going to be super expensive, you. and I have to save for it. <laughs> Zion? Things have changed. Uh, no, Zion's already paid for. Um, although, oh shoot, I do need to rent the car. Dude, listen to this. I doubt it. There's a bunch of stupid airport Come. fees. So the car rental is three hundred and twenty dollars, I think. I was like, oh, that's pretty reasonable for like a mid-sized SUV that would be able to handle oh, driving around in the mountains. Fight. And I go to check out and all of a sudden it's $520. And I'm like, hold on a second. That's not what you said before. But I guess they add like these 10, like multiple 10% charges because you're renting from the airport and there's like no alternative. And Andrew and I's flights land at like midnight. So we cannot be Ubering all over the place to find a different rental agency because we still have to drive from Vegas up to Zion, which is like three and a half hours. So it's going to suck. Yeah. But once um, we get there, it should be OK. Yeah, I uh, I remember dealing with rentals going into Vegas and I was not excited about it. Nope. The charges are stupid. Mm -hmm. I've never had that happen before. On my feet. Okay, my we'll end your turn. Carlac, come in here and bop him. Oh, also, I might get to do another dive while I'm there. I'm super excited. You're gonna they find another eight. turtle? No, no turtles, but it's, uh... It's like a lake and... Apparently, it's very common for them to sink items intentionally for divers, which makes sense when you think about it, but, like, I wouldn't have thought of that. So they have, like, a Cessna 210, they have, a like, a school bus, they have a helicopter just sitting at the bottom of this lake in, like, 40 feet of water. So that's the one I'm going to do. Huh. So it should be fun. And then I can take a picture sitting in the school bus, which I think will be fun. Oh, my God, please do. I know. Hopefully the visibility is good enough for a picture. I got a special dive housing for my GoPro so that I can take pictures. Because technically I was not supposed to take my GoPro down with me. Um, it's not technically waterproof past 33 feet. Oh, I was but like, I took what do you down. mean? I took it anyway. Classic. Um, it worked out. As soon as we got the thing with the, the turtle, my instructor was like, yeah, we're going to go back up and put the camera away. I still can't. I ring and scrub the words of ancient language. Alright. Have you been working a lot of overtime? Yes and no. Like, this past week. So we had off on Monday this past week. Uh, because it was Yom Kippur, and the owners of the company are Jewish, and during oh. that holiday, I oh, guess they're I didn't like... wish Seth and Kaylee happy Yom Kippur. You know what, they have so many holidays, I can't keep up do. with them all. I... Apparently it's like their most important holiday, though, because that's the only day the company, uh, like, completely Damn. shuts down. 
like well every other gosh. like holiday we work or we'll get called in for that is a day where the phones are turned off we will not go out and it doesn't even matter because like everyone else that like goes down to the field isn't jewish so it doesn't matter to us if we work that day or not but like because the owners of jewish are not allowed to i guess their company isn't allowed to make money or work or something like that um the door remains sealed no so, see, last week was slow. I'm probably going to use a PTO day for that day. I think the week before that, I only worked like two hours of overtime. But I think the week before that, so three weeks ago, I think I worked like 51 or 52 hours. Mm -hmm. So, but I got $2 raise starting this past week, so I'll take that. The ring slots perfectly into place. But nothing happens. Which I guess I didn't it's talk to you about. An hour. Yeah, that's a lot. As if it expects something else. But, uh... A strange writing on the door I, uh... In the candlelight. It's funny, I think I talked to Brooke about Perhaps this, but I don't think I told you. Um... Originally, the one... The door remains sealed with not oh, okay, to see so it's not good. Hang on. Let me try and figure this out real quick. The door remains I believe in sealed. You. I know you can do it. I'm, like, in a puzzly part, and I'm trying to figure out how I get... Into the spot. Perfectly into place. Nothing oh happens where you get a feeling from the door as if some if it expects How something you get else. Writing on the door glints in the candle. Well, that's great because I don't know what the fucking thing door says. Guess I'm gonna keep exploring. Um. Yeah. So like, I'm working Sunday to Thursdays now. No. Oh. Which I told you that. I think so because it, I put it in. A, I put in a group text. I know that. But uh, I'll give it a shot. Um, like the owner came up to me when he was in town a couple weeks ago, or one of the owners, and was like, "Hey, like, can I talk to you for a minute?" And I was like, "Fuck, like, all right, like." What's up? And I thought he was going to bring something else up. Actually, I did text you this, and you've responded to this. But he was like, yeah, I want to give you a raise. And I was like, okay, cool. And it started at, like, a dollar an hour. Mm -hmm. Or what he told me. And I was like, okay, cool. Like, I'll take that. Next day, he pulls me into uh, an office. And he's like, hey, we're trying to go do a Sunday to Thursday shift. Can you do that? And, like, immediately in my mind, I didn't say it to him, but in my mind, I was like, I wonder if this is one of the reasons you offered me that raise. Like, or told me you were going to give me a raise. So, like, kind of, like, reverse psyche me into... Accepting. Accepting. And I thought about this after, but, like, immediately, I just didn't want to say no. So, I was just like, yeah, I can do it. Like, I don't mind it. Like, Friday's off. I can get shit done that I need to do. Mm-hmm. And then, later that week... Uh, his son who works in the office that does payroll called me and was like, Hey, I know my dad said you're getting a raise. Did he tell you how much? And I was like, yeah, I think he told me a dollar. And he was like, well, no, uh, we're actually giving you a $2 raise. And I was like, oh, okay. Like, that makes me much more happy that I'm taking that Sunday to Thursday shift if that was part of it. Wait, what was your other? Sh what was your previous shift? What? What changed? Monday to Friday. Oh, I mean, yeah. It, it, honestly, yeah. I it's, wish that I had off days like that. Well, it, it really sucks nice. to work Sundays, partly because of football. Oh. And mm. the other aspect is, uh, like, I literally have Saturdays to do things with people, and that's it now. Oh, that's... Because, like, like, you know what I mean? Like, everyone else works... All my friends work Monday to Friday. Yeah. So it's like, if I, I need mean, to make friends... I'm make off plans, on Friday. Oh, I mean, I'm down to do stuff on Friday, son. Well, I every thought, other Friday, but... I mean, I'm still down. I'm working Sunday to Thursday for a bit. Until new know. people get trained up. We'll do top golf eventually. I just, like, physically okay. have no energy. <laughs> that's fair. Uh, where the f Oh, my... What the fuck am I doing here? I picked something up that I'm not aware of. Person smashed 
turned on me and forced me to bring Victoria along into the palace. I've had the best hunters. Just so I could stay in here with my daughter, keep her away from other spawn. Don't like the way Violet looks at her tonight at all when I asked Master what he plans to do with Victoria. Just gave me a wicked smile next time I go get out and hunt myself to Fiargo. I'm gonna oh, I, to deal with I have two Victoria's red eyes. Escape. Disguise. If only Why there's enough this time to ritual master talk about. At first I thought you meant like your physical eyes were red. Like in your body. <laughs> I mean I was also like, that. That pink eye? <laughs> Did someone fart on your face? Gross. Did your cats fart on your face? Wait, so have you beat Zelda yet, or no? Uh, no. Okay. Because I just I beat it today. And it sounds like Brooke also just beat it today. May we be worthy of you. It's hard, because there's so much to do. Yeah. At, at certain, like, I did, like, 90-some shrines, and I got to a point where it's like, I feel like I've checked everything. I've looked a lot, around a lot. I'm just going to finish it. Yeah. It was worth it. The ending was actually really good. Really? I I I said I think I did send a group text. That was probably one of the best final bosses I fought in a, almost any video game I've played. Oh really? Yeah, it was just so cool and so well done, and it also made me get good because I only had five hearts, so I had to fucking be good, and it like felt souls like to me. But uh, it it was it was good. And it sounds like Brooke also kind of struggled with it. Which helps me knowing I only had five hearts and had to not get hit. Uh, dictionary was used to train new servants on how to operate the ballroom door. Has gone missing. My signet ring. Alone won't do the job. Please have servants sort this out. Well, it shouldn't be my problem to solve. Goaty. Goaty, the servants and I thoroughly prepare, busy preparing for the master celebration. Get your bones out of the kennel. Search for every chamber for the vampire spawn on the vampire spawn level and quickly oh find that book. That is so many people. Where you at? I'm doing the, uh, the fight. What oh, are they for the portal? Prone, or what are they, uh... Oh, Radiant. Yeah. Do I have anything Radiant? If you have Shadow Heart, she has Guide and Bolt. Ooh, she does not, because I replaced it. Oh. Feels bad, man. Everything must be clean. Everything must no, no, no. Promises will have fresh meat. Really, nothing radiant? All we can eat bloody and rot. What am I? And they're resistant to basically everything else. So much to prepare. Uh. Everything really Wolves will not obey. Be alpha. Make them hear you. Who is talking right tonight? tonight oh, that was worse. thick. I must thick. be busy. Busy thick. Thick. Uh Ooh, he is what? way too close. <clears throat> what did this say? Parent Master Celebration, get your bones out of the kennel and search every chamber on the vampire spawn level and quickly find that book. Where's that vampire spawn level? Is it in here? Yes. Oh. Dude, I can just cast Shadow Guardians and walk around. <laughs> Shadow or Guardians? I'm sorry, Spirit spirit Guardians. Oh, yeah. It, it absolutely wrecked every single one. <laughs> yep. E. Z. Also, I don't know if it would work, but Turn on the Dead might work if you had Shadow Heart. So, that, here's the thing that bothers me. 
and rem correct me if I'm wrong, but doesn't turn undead in actual D&D &D just kill them? I think there's a role that you do. Yeah, but this doesn't but give you I that also, option. I know they changed things in this game from 5e because certain things would be just way too powerful. I guess, and yeah. And perhaps Turn Undead is undead. one of them that would be a little bit too powerful that they changed. <laughs> yeah. Because there are times oh, you where you're just what? straight up Hold fighting it's, Undead. It's because... Okay, no, I remember now. Maybe it's when you hit level 11, it becomes Bless Destroy Bless Undead. Maybe. Oh, maybe. But I don't know if th that would be kind of OP in a game where every single enemy... Yeah, a lot undead. of enemies in this game are Undead, and that would just be a little... A little too strong, for sure. Yeah. All right, I'll I'll allow it. Yeah, I know. Me and Seth were talking about. It. They definitely changed things. Or yeah, he was saying that they that. changed things because it would just be it would be too OP. What's the other thing? Um. Pick all that up. Add wares. Something with the druids, maybe? Like, you can only turn into one thing. Oh, you can't change into different animals, you mean? Yeah. Probably looking by giving him Nasty Rash or something, right? Now, if only I could get the Snob Leon and Spread Darter. Okay. Yeah, and, uh. What's their name? Is a panther. Jahira is a panther. Also, why do we have two druids? So here's know. the obvious winner. You're gonna hunt, take prey, yada yada yada. I I am a little upset you don't get to get a character of each class though. So. Yeah, I liked that one girl that's the bard. Wait, there's a girl that's a bard in this game? Not that you can have in your party. Oh. Yeah, exactly. It's cringe. I was like, you, you can't get a paladin, which I was hoping to get. Which means my next playthrough, I'm probably going to do a paladin. And maybe right. multi-class someone into bard. Yeah, the bard is the one that's upsetting me. Because there is literally a character that is a bard. Who? And you just can't play as her. She's, she takes care of the kids. Oh, the one I tried to break the uh, guitar for. Got it. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, you upset her and she left. But she's yep. in my camp. The master is pure. I kind of want this to cook longer, don't I? No, maybe not. Victoria's list. Oh. What's on your list, Victoria? Yeah. There are 17 paintings, but sometimes some of them are the same painting, except the later sometimes. Except that later, sometimes they are different again. 17 calabras, sometimes I light them, but the candles don't burn down. 17 chairs. Which is almost always too many. Father says, if I go into the ballroom, I will be bitten 17 times by 17 rats. I'm taking that because that sounds important. What the? Oh, are any of the, like, papers and stuff that you pick up important? Because I get rid of all of those. Just make sure you read them. I don't think I've found any that I needed to reread. Okay. It seems like usually if they're quest related, it will, it will put it in your quest, uh... The quest items. The journal. Or journal, yeah, yeah. That's good. Yeah. Just make sure you read them. Alright. I'm gonna run to the bathroom, give me a couple minutes, I'll be right back. <clears throat> we'll try and figure this out.